Okay, everybody. Um, I've just got done reading uh, your milestone ones. Um, overall, uh, very good work. Um, uh, uh, people are ready, uh, for the most part, to go on to um, the second milestone. But before we do, I want to cover a few things that I think I saw that, that were kind of consistent and recurring omissions that were made uh, by folks, okay? So, so please um, listen and take this, you know, please watch this when you see a pop-up in your email. Um, it's not, it's, you know, I'm not, it's not uh, uh, necessarily uh, unrelated to what you have to do, okay? Okay, so... <clears throat> This is mile uh, milestone one, okay. Um, and uh, you know, I mean, okay, y you know, okay. So this is supposed to be a final project. It's supposed to be, you know, to try to address a social problem, okay. And 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 this is you're gonna work. This works up into your final paper, okay. So so. Basically, you know, um, here are the critical elements that, that you need to keep in mind, you know, that, that I look for. Okay, basically, uh, and, and people, uh, you know, some people did you know, fine work, okay? You, you summarize your potential, you describe the problem. Variable and determinant, really a determinant is merely another word for a, a independent variable, okay? Okay. Um, you know, it, when I said local and global, I want to be clear about this because people people got often a few people got confused. Okay, when when we're talking about okay, um, when they talk about a global level, folks, okay, we're not talking about different ethnic groups in the United States. I mean, some people, like, they started going, okay, on a global level, um, these minority groups in the United States, no, they're in the United States. Okay, so global means somewhere not in the United, that doesn't have to do explicitly with the United States. A lot of people made this problem, and I, I, I told you to correct it. Now... I want to be clear, you don't have to take the whole world on, but if I'm looking, for example, at, um, oh, well, I'll give you an example, childhood obesity, right? Um, you can go to the World Health Organization website and compare the entire Earth with the United States, okay? You know, the aggregate data for all the countries in the world. Or, if it's something like uh, a lot of people did gun violence, okay? Please, keep in mind, um, you can use, uh, here's another thing you can do, you know, you can, you can examine another country that's similar to the United States. Like, if I compared Canada or the United Kingdom, right, you know, with the U.S., gun violence is just very, very different. It, it doesn't, you know, it's not that much of an issue in those places. So, global, that's what global means. Global doesn't mean different groups in the U.S. Or, and it doesn't mean you can kind of gloss over it and go, globally, this is a problem. A lot of people did that, and they kind of tried to write their way past that. No, that's not going to do, right? Um, the, the other thing that I saw, okay, um, you know, uh, was people, you know, now some, a lot of people, you know, um, successfully applied a sociological theory, okay? You know, I'm going to use conflict theory because this seems to be, you know, uh, a, you know, a, um, you know a, a group that's oppressed in some way and, and denied access to the resources other groups have. That, that's how you use conflict theory. Or I'm going to use functional theory because this is dysfunctional, you know, for a, a, um, a, a society to function well, right? You know, I mean, uh, so, you, and you, you can't just gloss past that. You know, people like did kind of a, oh, I'm going to use sociological theory to address the problem. 
not su that's not sufficient either. Okay, so I was looking for that. And, and another thing, uh, yes, it's 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 fine. Um, it's fine to you know to talk about your particular experience. Um, I, I had a student here uh, who uh, and among your classmates who experienced something very similar to me because we live in the same town, Cincinnati, Ohio. Right? Um, you'll he'll know who he, uh, he'll know who uh, I'm I'm dressing this when when uh, he talks. I mean he he uh, uh, and I I woke up to the same sorts of things that he did. You know, when we're talking about gun violence, right? Um, however, um, you can't. Your own experience is not the kind of data that you can make an assessment about, you know, that, that, that you can generalize to the entire uh, country uh, or other parts of the country or the world. You, you know, I mean, so, so you have to be specific. You can't write a paper about, like, crime is rampant. Crime is going down since 19, 1990, and that's not my opinion or my feeling, right? That's the data. We have to have data, you know. We have to have data, and you have to have references, okay? So when you make an ass assertion about something that you feel, right, um, you know, I mean, no, that's not going to do. You can make a brief statement about, well, I was alarmed by this because I see this happening, you know, in this community. And you can leave it, you can just, you know, use that as, to set it up. But if that's all you're writing about, that's that's not sufficient. That's not our purpose here. We're also not writing a reaction paper about how you feel or about how you're moved or anything like that, okay? When we're talking about bias, I think a lot of, some people didn't connect it. We're talking about, uh, yes, you, you have personal biases, and you can identify a few of those, but you, you, you know, you, you don't want to live in the bulk of your paper there. You, you, you use a theory to set it, uh, you know, to set your analysis up, okay, uh, in a way or to frame your analysis so that you can double check everyone is biased. There's no one in the world who is not biased, right? I mean, everybody is biased in one way or the other, you know, I mean, okay, so, um, you know, I mean, uh, you know, uh, here are the things, cultural awareness, research and synthesis of information. Another thing I saw that was a problem is people hand me a series of quotes, you can't do that. Data analysis, what does the data tell us? Some people did excellent Critical thinking means basically all of the above. Problem analysis and solving and then working on your own. Okay. So, uh, so you know, I mean, uh, and another thing too, you have to be specific. A couple of people write, like, try to write the history of racism. That, that we can't. This gentleman here, W.B. Du Bois, he wrote 127 volumes. He started 130 years ago, and and wrote right up until 1968. I don't think you're gonna you're gonna be able to put you know that into a paper. So you know, I mean, some problems are so huge, like racism, for example. You get to acknowledge that it's a gigantic constellation of problems, and specify one, uh, you know, one process that we want to look at here. Not the hist. I don't need a history. Of race of structural racism, it's impossible to put in a paper, right? Okay, um, so um, you you know that's uh, you know that that you know that's kind of my overview, my my feedback for this um, this milestone one. Please, please read the feedback and please respond to the feedback that I provided you in the paper. Okay, most everybody did excellent work. But you've got to, you got to kind of, you know, know, know what globalism, uh, global, you know, global means. Apply it. It's not comparing, you know, 
um, you know, something in the United States, you know, um, uh, that that's not global. All right. Uh, and then, and what theory is. Okay, peace, and I hope you're having a great weekend. Thank you very much.